Hey everyone, this is Pharaoh Silver, the Pharaoh of Beer Money Finance, and it has been about an hour after, it's 10.30 right now, uh, my time. So it's an hour and a half after the event, and I my hands are still shaking. Um, don't adjust your screen. That is actually me. I finally did it. I won Atlas Golf. And I had another video set up here. But I thought this one was a little bit too important because it's my first mini game win ever. Uh, I've gotten a couple seconds before in golf, and I know I just podiumed racer on Monday. Uh, but that was a test racer. Uh, got third place. That was great. But this one is a big one for me. And I just am just like, you know, this has been a year in the making. And I wanted to thank everyone who supported me, everyone here on the channel as well. Um, telling me that, you know, it, you know, everything, I, I'm still speechless, guys. I'm still very speechless. I'm sorry. Woo, wow. So, um, I did want to talk about, uh, I normally don't talk about minigames on this channel, but because I won this one, I want to talk about maybe what I did differently here that led me to a win, and maybe it might help you improve your gameplay if you play the minigames as well. So the first thing that I did a little bit differently was um, the screen. So normally I play with adaptive brightness and sometimes that will brighten or dull my screen depending on if there's a light on or if there's a light off. And well, needless to say, I just turned it completely on like not full blast, but like enough that I was able to see it. And for some odd reason, that made a difference. So that actually makes a difference in the cursors. Like I'm actually able to see when the cursor hits the four a little bit better after I see it brighten up, which, you know, you wouldn't think it'd make too much of a difference, but I guess because the duller yellow on the four um, compared to that cursor, uh, I guess the difference between that and seeing it a little bit brighter because the shade between the cursor and the four pointer is a little different. So that probably helps. Um, the second one is connection. Now, uh, unlike old racer that had connection issues and I admit it had connection issues there. In this case, um, I had a little bit less connection issues than normal, and I probably also got helped a little bit by usual veterans, a lot of veterans actually getting more issues than normal. Um, there's been a lot of talks about delays, and I did get a few of that, but like I got about the same amount that I always did, maybe a little less. So that might have been a factor as well, and I hate to think that connection issues would be an issue even in golf. It is less of an issue in golf than it is in like racer and fishing and sometimes bowling, but it's there. Um, golf is the least connection based in my opinion. Actually, Warship is probably the least connection based, but golf is honestly the, um, it's probably a close second. The final thing I did different was I stopped mulliganing. Yeah, so... I had been doing top 25s in golf, but I've been mulliganing mainly because I was a little bit worried and didn't want to take that risk to lose Atlas Bucks. But, you know, sometimes you got to take that risk. And tonight that risk paid off. Um, it would have normally been, you know, a thousand Atlas Bucks for me tonight. But instead, I'm getting thirty six hundred. Uh, I spent I did mulligan the first 45 minutes because I was eating dinner. I was not planning on it. But then I just started getting this winning streak of like 20 or 25 in a row. And I was like, okay, let's see how far I can go. Next thing I knew, I went from like 60th all the way to 15th. And I was like, all right, I'll go a little bit more and see if I can do it. Next thing I knew, I was fourth. Or no, fifth. I was fifth. And then I was like, okay, I'll keep going at this. And then before I knew it, I saw my face in the third place spot. And I was like, well, I'm committed now, ain't I? So, yeah. <laughs> Uh, again, I was planning on another video here. That video is being moved to next Wednesday. Um, I'm, I'm very busy with other stuff. Uh, I'm clearly not going to be working on this on Thursday. I know Thursday is the warship event. 
uh, Warship, I'm probably just going for top 500. I'm going to be more focused on my on-call duties. I'm working a 12 on Thanksgiving. Yes, I am. Um, and then Sunday will be bowling, and I'll probably do a little bit more then. We'll see. But I'm still going to be like kind of you know, on call and still working on Sunday as well. So I got a busy week ahead of me. That's partially why you're seeing, you know, more impromptu videos like this the next week or so. And will through um, the month in review, which I plan to get out on the 7th of December. And we will resume on the 10th. All right, everyone. So um, thank you, everyone. Finally won one make an entire video on it. I had to do it today. You know, I had to do it. Oh, actually, hang on, guys. Uh, I just got the payouts. So give me a second here. And there it is, everyone. Ain't it beautiful? <laughs> yeah, I actually finally pulled it off. And I think I won this one by two. Yeah, I won this one by two over by design and Mark Cuban. It was fun, y'all. Uh, these two hours, this was really adrenaline pumping. And then in North Carolina, I won by 20 plus on Glaston. Thank you, Glaston. Finally did it. And it's official, y'all. My first mini game win. Had to show it. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it, everyone. So uh, if you like this video, please give it a like. Comment on how you did in the Atlas mini game. Uh, let me know uh, what your plans are going forward. And uh, yeah, I'm going to go put this down and in the month in review, I will talk about uh, just how much a first place will get you as an increase in monthly income. So I think I'm sitting at, and I'm going to keep a note here for myself on this video, I'm currently sitting at $59.24 a month. That is $9.25 a month after the Explorer Club. So I will keep that as a note here. And we will talk about it in the month in review where I land afterwards. All right, everyone? So, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it, everybody. Uh, like, comment, subscribe to Beer Money Engine. I will see you all Saturday. There will be no Beer Money Brew Saturday. There will be a roundtable in its place. And we're doing recording on that tomorrow. All right. Thank you, everyone. This is Pharaoh Silver signing out. Bye, everyone.